Hi everyone and welcome to a new video. I have something really, really cool to show you guys. I've made an AI language partner application. Let's check it out. Okay, so we're gonna start a new chat here. I'm going to pick German as my language of choice. I'm gonna pick intermediate as my level because I'm an intermediate German learner. And we can actually talk about whatever we want here, but I've recently been on a holiday to Costa Rica and that's what I wanna talk about. So I'm gonna select that. Okay, so we're in the chat. You can see here that if you want, you can just chat to it via text, but I actually wanna to talk to it. So we're gonna press this icon. Mir geht's gut, danke. Und dir? Ja, ich war in Costa Rica vor zwei Wochen. Viele, viele Dinge eigentlich. Ich habe Fahrrad gefahren, äh, wandern, äh, surfing und mehr. Ja, das Essen hat sehr gut geschmeckt. So, as you can see here, having a conversation with the AI. It's able to transcribe exactly what I'm saying. It's also able to follow the context of what I'm saying. So the conversation is flowing very naturally. It's able to respond very well to what I'm saying. And it's able to keep the conversation context centered around my holiday in Costa Rica, like I asked it to. We can also get translations for everything that the AI has said. So all of the responses. So for example, hast du ein Lieblingsspeise entdeckt? Have you discovered a favorite dish? You can get a translation for everything. Not only the AI's responses, but also your own responses too. You can get a translation for those and also a correction for those as well. So if you've said something wrong, then it can correct that. So if we look here, you can see that I use the incorrect tense for some of these things. So I use the present tense instead of like referring to it in the past. So that's corrected that. And that I can also, if you look here, I can get a translation of my sentence as well. So many, many things actually. I've been biking, hiking, surfing and more. And then if we look down here, this sentence should be correct, I think. Yes, so look at this, it says it's correct. So this is super useful. You can talk about absolutely anything you want with the AI. You can get translations, you can get corrections. Yes, it works incredibly well. And yeah, I hope you, you guys give it a use. So I hope you enjoyed that little demonstration there. And I wanna to explain to you why this is so useful and why I made it. So the first thing I wanna to talk to you guys about is anxiety. So when you're speaking a foreign language for the first time maybe, there's lots of pauses, there's lots of breaks. You have to find the words in your head, you have to form the sentences. It can be quite uncomfortable when you're speaking to somebody else and they have to wait for you and they have to be really patient. And that's all well and good maybe if you're paying somebody else, but if you've actually got just a language tandem partner, it can just be a bit awkward. And with an AI language partner, there's none of that. It has an inf infinite amount of time to wait for you, to be patient for you. And yeah, it basically just reduces the level of anxiety in language learning and speaking a foreign language when you use an AI language partner versus a real language partner. The second thing is that there's no organization involved. You basically just go onto the application and 24 seven, 365 days a year, you can talk to this AI language partner. When you have a real language partner, you have to organize everything. And it's even more difficult if, for example, you're learning a language where the population is on the other side of the planet and there's a different time zone, the whole organization of it can be very complex and complicated and you have to find a time that works and it's just, it's not easy. And then if you're paying for somebody else, right, this is the third thing, it can be very expensive. So for example, if you're using an application like italki and you're paying for a tutor or a language conversation partner, depending on the language, that could probably range from like $6 to $20 plus per hour. And if you're learning a language like, I don't know, Swedish or something that's really complex, 
you're gonna to have to pay for an expensive tutor. So yeah, it might be 20 plus dollars an hour. And if you imagine that maybe you have to, you have to spend maybe 200 hours learning that foreign language, speaking that foreign language just to reach conversational fluency, that's 200 multiplied by 20, that's $4,000 that could potentially cost if you're using a tutor. And that's really expensive, right? That's super expensive. You know, if you're committed to it, fair enough, but you could use a tool like my AI language partner where you pay $15 a month. That's the price that it is currently. It's probably gonna to have to increase soon. You know, $15 per month versus like $2,000. That's like, it's a no brainer. It's considerably cheaper and you get most of the same experience. The other thing is the AI language partner offers 35 different languages at the moment. It also offers three different language levels. So beginner, intermediate and advanced, depending on what your level is. And you can basically talk about absolutely anything, whatever you want, you can talk about. The other thing is that it offers translations and it also offers corrections for everything that you say and for everything that the AI says as well. So all of the responses from the AI, you can translate so you know exactly what it's saying and also everything that you say, you can get corrections for. So this is really, really useful. This isn't really possible with an actual language partner or tutor because it's, well, it is possible, but it's slow. It's really slow. You know, it, it breaks up the conversation and it's just, it's no longer naturally flowing when you constantly have to pause and then they have to like respond with the correct answer and so on. Whereas the AI can just do this as you're talking to it without any break in the conversation flow. So it's really, really super useful for any language learner. And I really hope that you guys can give this a go. And you can let me know in the comments if you think that it's useful to you. If you have any feature requests or anything that you think I could improve on, let me know in the comments again. If you want to try it out, the link to the application is in the description box. Yes, yeah, so thank you very much for watching. I hope you guys can use the tool and I hope that it really helps you. So thanks a lot for watching and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye.